Hey everybody, welcome to tonight's pour. Now, tonight's pour is going to be a Hot Wheels themed painting. Now, I came down here just to get some painting done. Thought, well, I'll just go through the Hot Wheels collection, see what inspires me. Uh, <clears throat> nothing was really hitting me until I saw this one. And I've done a few VW Bugs. This is what I'm going to do tonight. I've done a couple of them before. I've done some uh, some of the the vans, the VW buses, I think they call them as well. And uh, <clears throat> I have one VW Bug painting still for sale. And a lot of people at the last show were, you know, really liked it, but they nobody bought it. But I thought I'd do another one to so give them a few more choices in case that wasn't exactly what they wanted. So as you can see, this one has flames on it. So, but the flames are more orange and yellow. So I think that's what I'm gonna stick with is orange and yellow coming out the back. And the color that I have picked for the background is actually, and I haven't done this color before, but it's a red ochre. And it's by Master's Touch. So I've already got all the paints mixed. The orange will also be Master's Touch, just regular orange. And then I think it's a lemon yellow, also in Master's Touch. Um, I already have those in some squirt bottles mixed up, so I don't have the tubes out right now to show you. But those are the brands that I'm using. And so I'll probably use a little white in there as well. So I've already got the paint down on the canvas, so let's get started. Okay, as you can see, I have the red ochre down. And so we're going to do... Some orange and some yellow. And we're going to put a little white in there. We can always add some more if we need it. Light, light. We will definitely add some more. Sorry, I got some black on me. This must be some wet paint on the table.
think that's all I'm going to do with it. So we'll have our, our car right there. And I have never used the red ochre as a background, but it'll probably probably be turn out pretty good I think especially with these yellows and oranges and we'll see how it looks when it dries and then we'll especially see how it looks once we get that resin on there it'll probably pull those colors out make them pop I think that'll be a good piece all right we've got this dried got the back taped Using Pro Marine resin on this 10 by 20 canvas, I'm using seven ounces. Three and a half the hardener, three and a half the epoxy. I'm sorry if the camera view is a little off. This is a brand new tripod and I'm already don't like it. I have to get another one. One, I don't like how it clamps my phone. It's very, it's not easy. Not like the one that I had over here. The other one I have, which that one did break or one of them broke, but it has more of a kind of like a chip clamp on it if you know what I mean like a chip bag clamp where you just as a handle on the on both sides and you just squeeze it together and opens up this one is more of a spring action so I don't like that part of it because it's hard to get my phone in and out of it for recording and then the thing is just spinning around. So I finally got it tight enough, but it's, I had it tight bef before and I started recording and I right when I hit the record button, it started flipping around. So getting it tight and keeping it there kind of doesn't have the best angle. So sorry about that, but I will be getting a new one. And that's kind of why if you've watched some of my videos, I don't, hadn't recorded putting the resin on. And that's why, because I didn't have a tripod over there. So I was just kind of holding my phone and recording me placing the car in once the resin was already done. So... I need I need some more resin, so I need to order some off Amazon, but I gotta find a different tripod. This one's not working. I'll probably do that tomorrow because usually usually I get started about sometime after nine in the evening. My wife goes to bed around nine most evenings. This is the weekend, so she'll stay up a little bit more. But it's usually ten or ten thirty by the time I get started. Sometimes, 9.30 or whatever. So tonight we actually went, we went out. We don't do a whole lot. Sometimes. We're usually just home. But we, um, in the town we actually both work in, they have a uh, summer concerts, free concerts in the in this little park area. So we went to the last one of the year, the summer, and it was a Pink Floyd cover band. Now it's not so much that we went because it was a Pink Floyd cover band, but just to go to a free concert. 
and just to do something other than staying at home watching TV. So we went and ate and went out to eat and then we, which the restaurant we went to eat at was right next to the park where they hold the concerts. And we had a good time. We saw some friends. Some we hadn't seen in a few years. And so we had a good time. It was, they weren't too bad. I'm, I never was a big... I like Pink Floyd, but I never was a big, big fan of it. Now, I have been doing some Pink Floyd paintings. Again, it still doesn't mean that I'm a big Pink Floyd fan. I did like, I do like their songs, but for some reason tonight, I could only think of before when I heard we were going, I'm like, I don't even remember. I know I know another brick in the wall. I mean, that's their, probably their most famous one, their biggest hit. So I do remember that one, but I was like, boy, I don't, I can't recall any other songs that they did that I know. So, oh, well, I'll probably, I'll probably they'll start playing and I'm like, oh yeah, oh, I didn't know they sang that song. So that's what happened. Oh yeah, I forgot they sang that or, oh, I didn't know they sang that song. stuff in there all right I think I about got it so anyway they were actually pretty decent they weren't bad they, they sound pretty good I took a few videos and some songs we didn't stay for the whole thing it was from I think they were on from 8 to 10 there was a, a warm-up band it wasn't too bad from like 6 to 8 so but we stayed for about an a little over an hour and see that thing just disappeared. And uh, we did get to hear another brick in the wall. And that was basically the only one. And it, you know, again, it's not Pink Floyd themselves, it's Pink Floyd cover band. So, but it's still cool to hear it. All right, so we have the car right here. I'm going to set it right here. So there we have it. I have never used brown as a background, but it looks pretty good, especially with the car on there. Got the orange with the black. I didn't put any black in it, but we got orange and yellow coming out the back flames. I think it's a pretty cool piece. So if you like this one, hit the like button. Comment. Oh, excuse me. It's late. What I was going to say is I got started late. I didn't actually get down here until after midnight. So it's probably close to 1, 1 a.m. now because I did do a painting as well. So that's why I'm sorry. That's why I'm yawning. But leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, shame on you. You should be subscribing. Thanks for watching.